Welcome back to another episode of MotoGP Mac and today we're going to talk about the rumors and I say rumors that Honda have asked Calix to redesign their MotoGP bikes chassis. Now these are still rumors we don't know or have any confirmation that this rumor is or has any basis to it but let's have a look at where Honda were in the Portimao test. We know that Honda brought a new and updated frame that was used in the Sepang test to the Portimao test and from my understanding Marquez dismissed this new frame and reverted back to the one that he had in Malaysia. Now the one that he had in Malaysia was a tweak to the one they had in Valencia. So there is definitely a problem with the frame. Now this leads me to believe, you know, is there any truth to the rumor? I think ideally there is truth to it, but again, I am not sure. This would be a massive step for Honda to admit that they couldn't engineer the chassis like they've done for many years and move on. Whatever about Calix helping out with the swing arm, which to be fair, all Hondas are now running the aluminium Calix swing arm. So there is definitely a bit of trust between the two companies that one knows what the other is doing. But again, this is a massive, massive step and undertaking for Honda to farm out. The other side of the coin is, do they have any choice? They've built three, four, five, six frames for Mark at this stage, and they still cannot give him what he wants and what he needs in order to make that bike handle the way he needs it to handle. So there is plenty of bias to say there that this actually does need to happen. I'm just not sure if after a poor session in Portimao and uh, Sepang, Honda are very quick to pull the trigger and say, oh yeah, we're gonna go do it now. I just don't think that's the way the Japanese will work there and especially with Honda. I think if there is any truth to this, I probably think the frames that they're using now are currently Calix frames that they're running in. It is very weird that the Japanese would make an instant decision like this. So I know there is talk, especially within that article is in Speed Week that they're saying the 1st of May test in Hereth that this chassis could take place. I think it's going to be very hard to tell. I don't think Honda are going to publicize it. Um, and look, it is pure speculation that this is going to happen. But for me, I will be honest, I think it makes perfect sense that Honda would farm out the chassis engineering I don't know and I kind of look in this way if the article is saying that it could be there for the 1st of May we are now in the middle of March um, and I think that's a very short and probably too short of time for Calix to turn around and build a frame from scratch. I personally believe if Calix are in involved with this frame it's been involved for a long time probably from the time of the swing arm so um, I don't think this is a knee-jerk reaction from Honda if I'm very honest but I would definitely love to know your thoughts what do you think of the whole situation with the frame do you think this was already in the mix with Honda or do you think that it is a knee-jerk reaction for Honda Definitely let me know your thoughts in the comments below and I'll be back again tomorrow with another video.